We have another sporting event tonight after the Royals. This is Sporting KC at Children's Mercy Park. 7 o'clock kickoff, 90 degrees, feeling a little hotter than that with sunshine. Starlight for the rest of the game, 9 o'clock, 87 degrees. Pretty nice conditions. Overnight lows. Now, we're not going to be as cool as what we were this morning or as crisp. It was dry and relatively cool. Tomorrow morning, it's going to be in the mid 70s and you're going to feel the humidity. We'll have a mostly clear sky overnight, about 72 to 75 degrees when you start your Monday. You notice the streamers here. That's a strong south wind tomorrow. And once again, we'll see highs well over 90, about 92 to 95 with heat index values during the peak heating of the day. So that's between 2 o'clock and about 6 o'clock, close to 100 degrees. Here's your hour by hour for Monday for Kansas City. A lot of sunshine in the morning, but you'll begin to notice increasing clouds across the north and west sky. We'll get to that in just a moment. High temperature, 93 degrees. That's when we'll have those feel like temperatures from 95 to 100 and strong south winds, possibly gusts over 20 miles an hour. So I mentioned later in the day, increasing clouds from the north and the west. This is our first of several rounds of showers and thunderstorms coming in Monday evening and Monday night along a cool front and those storms making it to Kansas City by the Tuesday morning drive. You notice there the red, so there's going to be some thunderstorms there and then those will quickly race south and east toward Butler, Clinton, Sedalia and Marshall by 9 o'clock in the morning. And there are some ingredients that will support a couple of severe thunderstorms. A Tuesday morning is a ways away, but that type of a setup, usually we can get some strong thunderstorms, some strong wind gusts. So we're going to be watching that very closely Monday night into early Tuesday morning. Now you'll notice Monday night all the way through Thursday morning, we're more than likely going to have several rounds of rain and thunderstorms during the night as well as during the day. Highs are not going to be in the 90s. They'll be in the 80s with the recent rain and the thunderstorm activity. Uh, Thursday afternoon might be the only <laughs> storm-free day of the week.